Okay, guys. Remember, this is part two. Part one was when my brother was mixing and following, is what we call it in Samoan, the pancakes with his hand. And he's certified because he has this, you know, Polynesian tattoo. So this is his pancake right here. It's a little light and it's kind of hard on the outside, a nice crunch. And then our mother came and she made these little alien looking pancakes. And she didn't follow it with her hand. She used a silver spoon. So that's B, my mother's pancakes. And this is A, my brother's pancakes. So which ones do you think taste better? Go ahead and comment below and let me know. And then I'll tell you which ones were better. So I was telling my mom with her special made pancakes, like they look like aliens. They look like things, right? So I told her, mom, look at this. Like, I'm afraid. Like if I bite it, it might bite me back or scratch me. Wow, it kind of looks like an elephant. And in Samoan, I told her, mom, look at those pancakes. So I just translated in English what I just said in, I mean, I translated in Samoan what I said in English. So they're very, um, you know, like artistic, but dude, they're good. So my mom is obviously the professional at making the pancakes, but my brothers look nice. And my mother's look weird, but she knows what she's doing when it comes to pancakes. So go ahead guys, take a guess at which one was better, A, my brother's, or B, my mom's. But I say, as long as the pancake was made with love in Samoan alofa, as long as it was made with alofa, I'll eat it, I'll take it. Because love and taste, you know, they go side by side. Okay, guys, comment below and let me know which ones you guys think were the best one. Have a good evening.